Hello friends, I'm Oom and today I have two amazing applications which will help you in your day-to-day -day life with amazing efficiency. So let's get started. So let's start with the first one, Gradia. So you might think like what is this? Well, it is some sort of a screenshot slash editor tool. Just go on with click a screenshot. Yeah, you, would, you just need to have a normal screenshot just like that. Just like if I go on with my Spotify and let's say I take a screenshot of it. Window, let's go on with this one. Take a screenshot. And now when I go to open image and choose that particular screenshot, for example, this one. You see, this is the best way if you want to grab a screenshot and edit it. Let's say we have this gradient. Now I want to match the colors. So I'm going to go with a little greenish ones. I can have it like this or I can turn a few things to make it look good and I can change the angle of how I want it to be. You see the way it is changing the whole gradient. It is indeed amazing. And then you have the option to add shadows to the background which will look damn good. And then corner radiuses. Well, let's go on with a little more corners. Let's go on with 50. Okay, 50 is way too much. Let's go on with 20 yeah maybe and then padding and everything else you can actually add custom well what do we say we can actually change things here we can write anything we want to over it we can add text for example if i go here and i go to the padding and fix a few things for example i want it like this and then i want to add text here let's say let she know enter okay and then increase the size a lot let you know as you can see we can just drag and drop it to here and then we can fix the padding if we want to just like that we can add lines if you want like these and even arrows if you want to point out to something and then we have the ability to make shapes and other stuff like it is indeed a great screenshot tool in my opinion and you will agree with me and we can also make things blurred or distorted, I'd say, which is a really, really helpful tool for anyone in my opinion. Or you can add a few numbers here and there, whatever. Like you have most of the options you would ever need. And then you have some pre-made templates for these things as well. Yep, you do. And the best part is that it is available on Flatpak, so you can install it on any Linux distribution. You just have to paste it and enter and you have a whole picture of it. Yep, that's how amazing this application Gradia is or Gradia, I don't know. And any screenshot you will take will automatically appear in Gradia because it is directly accessing your screenshot library. Now the next tool we have is, let me just show you right here. Its name is Packet. Now you might wonder what the hell is Packet? Well, you can easily receive and share your files from Android devices using Quick Share with this particular application. Yes, that is right. There we go. This is Packet. It is just like a simple and minimalistic airdrop for Linux. And you can send files from here as well. Just like that. Then you have to hit send and then any person with an Android device will appear here if they have quick share turned on to all devices or everyone there you see this is my phone Om Narayan I can just click it and it will go there well you know what I mean don't you let me just do it again but with a better way just like that it will show on my phone that it is fair ready and it will show the code ask me to pair I'll pair it up and I will receive the image just in a second and there we go just like that. It is really an amazing and beautiful and aesthetic way because I like the whole workflow of how we do it. Because this application packet is pretty minimal as you can see. Way better than what you get on Windows or even sometimes Mac OS. Yes, Mac OS is a little better but still this is better for me on Linux. And you can do the same here as well. You, can, you just have to share it with Quick Share and then you will have the computer on your nearby devices you just send it and it will show a prompt here as well there it is 
incoming transfer accept and it will receive the image I sent from my phone. This is really amazing in my opinion. Just like that. And there it is, file received and it's the same image. Yep, this one. So yep, these are amazing applications in my opinion for any day-to-day -day life. Now there are a lot of applications as well, other applications, some which you might never even heard of, but I'll review them in the future videos of our channel. And for that, don't forget to subscribe, I'll meet you in the next video, till then, I'm Moon, signing out.